Welcome back gang to another hair tutorial. This kid hairstyle, I'm taking y'all from this matted, tangled, dry, just needs help to this wonderful Christmas holiday kids hairstyle with uh, these adorable buns and I added in these uh, cute diamond accessories and those aren't hair baubles, those are ornaments because I'm extra. So we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into tutorial. I'm gonna show you how to get those straight parts and how to achieve this cute kid holiday hairstyle. Let's jump right in. Here we have the wonderful Lonnie, my middle child. She is six years old, representing type two wavy hair. And my goodness, it is long and gorgeous. But on those days I decide not to touch it, it gets matted and tangled and just terrible. So after 20 minutes of carefully detangling her hair, this is what we're working with. And I'm gonna jump right into styling her hair. I'm first going to do her parts. I go in doing a half up, half down part where you go right across the crown of the head from ear to ear and I am going to be braiding the front half of her hair while the back half is going to be into two cute little buns. To achieve the perfect parts, you are going to need some braiding gel. I recently discovered this secret, so now I feel like I have to share it all the time because I struggle with creating straight parts. So all you're gonna need is some braiding gel. I use, um, I believe it's called Let's Jam. You can purchase it from Walmart and it is like perfect. As you can see, those parts are crisp clean. Once our parts are made, we are then gonna go in with our hair product. Our hair product feature for this month, or this video, is the Mayel Organic Curl Smoothie. It's a pomegranate and honey line. I absolutely love the entire collection of the pomegranate and honey, but I really, really, really love this curl smoothie. It is a nice, thick, like, lotion consistency, and it has a glamorous smell. I really love how delicious it smells. Like, it really just, like, masks everything. So, it just gives you, like, this fruity sweet smell we're gonna go in with two pumps on each section as you know we are doing four sections on Lonnie's hair so I go in with two pumps and then I'm gonna start braiding her hair once we smooth in all of that curl smoothie now I'm going in with my let's jam braiding gel as you can see those edges are laid and then we are going to begin braiding I go in with a simple corn roll and I'm just gonna do a close-up so you guys can see how I braid her hair So of course you guys know I love doing my tutorials in a story. So I have a cute little story for y'all about my crazy erotic little Lonnie. So um, recently we went to go visit my mother's house. They call her Mama Lady. And um, as we're driving through her neighborhood, cause she kind of lives deep in her neighborhood, we're like passing all of the Christmas lights cause it's Christmas time right now. Everyone has their Christmas decorations up and everything all in their front yards. There's just lights everywhere and the girls love it. And then the previous night, we had took the girls riding through, you know, a couple of neighborhoods around our house so they could see everyone's lights and, you know, just gawk and awe, you know, stuff like that. So. We're going to my mom's house and they're pointing out all the lights and how everyone's house just looks wonderful and they're pointing out all the snowmans and the snowflakes and the Grinches, like it was just cute. So <laughs> heading there, you know, uh, Kalia's just like, oh my goodness, I hope Mama Lady put up some Christmas decorations. And you know, I already knew my mom, it, like she, she doesn't have any kids. All her kids are grown. Her youngest child is like 23, 24. So my mom is definitely not decorating. And so I already knew that was just like, yeah, right. Mama lady's not even gonna decorate at all. She barely decorated when we were kids. I know for sure she is not decorating. But I didn't say nothing. I was just gonna let the girls, you know, see. So we're heading down my mom's street and there's like a couple of houses that have some lights up. And as we get closer, the girls can see that Mama Lady didn't put any lights up. So Khalil was just like, oh man, you know, Mama Lady didn't put any lights up. I can't believe she didn't put any Christmas lights up. And Alani, like on a cue, just lazy, just, I mean, she was so disgusted that my mom did not put up any lights. She just, oh, oh Mama Lady's just lazy. Like, how dare she not put up any Christmas lights? <laughs> and 
me and Christian just like bust out laughing because we're just like, I can't believe we just called your grandma Lacey. Like, what kind of grandchild does that? So my mom wasn't even home when we pulled up because I just could not wait to tell her that her, her own grandchild called her Lacey because I just love rubbing that kind of stuff in my mom's face. We just like picking at each other. So um, we had to go there to like help put her put up a, tree, a, a, a TV for her. But yeah, I was just like, oh my goodness, Lonnie is just like the most like lately her outbursts have just been hilarious she did another one where <laughs> christian had christian's been doing a lot of grilling on the on the grill lately like he loves throwing out some hamburgers and hot dogs like every other day he's trying to grill something so one night he had grilled like some hot dogs and some bratwurst now the girls don't usually eat the bratwurst one because those are bigger links and i don't feel like they'll finish them so i just buy them a pack of hot dogs so um, I think they had finished up all their hot dogs, but there were still a couple of bratwurst left. So Christian's making dinner. He was just like, hey, Lonnie, there's like one hot dog left. You know, we still have a lot of bratwurst. Do you want a hot dog or, you know, a bratwurst? And she kind of looks at him and she's just like, what the freak is that? <laughs> like, I almost choked on my freaking drink. I was just like, who are you? Like, what in the world? And she said it's so hard. Like, I could have sworn she probably cussed. I'm pretty sure she cussed. But I, I'm going to believe that she just said freak. But <laughs> she, she, I mean, she just, like, looked at him like, what the freak is that? Like, I'm supposed to eat something? I don't even know it. <laughs> and, I mean, usually it's our youngest one who is savage. But Lonnie and her savagery has just been on it lately. And I just can't help but just crack up. So, <laughs> we... <laughs> We try to like sit her down and like discuss Lonnie, you shouldn't talk like that. But girl, bye, that must be hilarious. I just can't help but to laugh. So anyways, back to the tutorial. I'm showing you guys how I wrap her buns. I don't do the traditional where you just fold it all over. I, I don't know, that, that's how I grew up doing it where you just fold it over the donut bun and kind of tuck the hair in. Instead, I wrap her hair around it, kind of like a little Ferris wheel kind of thing. and um. This helps because she has a lot of hair. She has very long hair. So this is the only way I can get her donut bun to look, you know, good. And then don't worry about the flyaways. I go in with a hair nut and this is going to also help hold all that hair in place. I learned this trick from going to Disney. The girls did the little like boutique, the bibbidi bobbidi boot boutique and they did a bun. So I just thought that was really cute and I really like the idea. So I use it now whenever I do any kind of bun on the girls. Now, since it is Christmas time, of course I am extra. We are adding in some extra accessories because like, go big or go home. I use actual ornaments on her hair versus some baubles. I had baubles. I just didn't want to use baubles. I feel like ornaments would have made it a whole lot better. And plus, Lonnie was all for it. She was going around telling everybody she had ornaments in her hair. Of course, I'm not finished. I had to add in these diamond cute studs. Now, these <laughs> actually came from a crafting project that I did like a couple of years ago. And I just still had this box just still in the in the box so i just decided to add them to our hair so i decided to go in with some hair glue that was all that was used here it was some simple hair glue that will wash right out so i don't want anybody to think that you know i'm using like some nail glue or super glue simple hair glue that was can purchase it from your local beauty supply store and i just stud down uh going down across her braid now even lonnie was a little scared at first because as i'm putting the studs in and she's like loving it but she's like looking at what I'm using to put the studs in. And she was just like, well, mommy, um, is that hair glue? And I was like, yeah, yeah, it's hair glue. It's what I'm using to make sure they, you know, don't fall out your hair. She was just like, uh, okay, I was about to say. And I was like looking at her like, about to say what? What you supposed to do to me? I'm your mama. <laughs> but yes, that was all that was used here with some simple hair glue. And oh my goodness, she just looks Christmas ready. And this is a completed look for our gorgeous Lonnie. Now I'm gonna get her dressed and of course take some cute photos for Instagram. Thank you guys for watching if you're still watching us on this video if you aren't already please hit that subscribe button and hit that like button thank you so much please have a happy holiday merry christmas happy new year be blessed and be safe